Over an hour after an off-duty police officer reports a strange object in the sky, two F-16s are closing in on their target. Captain Muehlbergs has a radar lock-on. He's just about to intercept when the target suddenly appears to take evasive action. The target was rapidly reacting, changing heading and attitude and, and speeds. The target starts to move radically around the pilot's radar screen. The performance of that object is really outstanding. We had speeds going from very low speed until supersonic speed, so it was quite difficult to intercept that type. The pilots made nine attempts to intercept the object, but they never actually saw it with their own eyes. It existed only on radar. So what caused the blip on the radar that night? So what we're seeing here is the radar data collected from the F-16 radar. Dr. Ravi Raj Advi is an engineering professor who specializes in radar signal processing. His first question is if the target was an artifact of weather. I don't believe so because this is not consistent with the profile of something that would be natural. Dr. Advi consults a graph of the radar data. We see that the target falls down to about 6,000 feet, but then it rapidly gains height and then starts falling at an extremely rapid rate to the point where it almost crashes into the ground. The extreme acceleration captured on the F-16's radar is beyond the performance of any known aircraft. But Dr. Advi may provide an answer to what Captain Muehlbergs pursued that night. His examination suggests not an alien spacecraft, but a military hoax. It is my feeling that this is a fake target created by an electronic countermeasure system to spoof this radar. It's a technique known as radar jamming. This kind of technology is used by military defense applications. They are used to create false targets so that an enemy radar believes that there are many aircraft out there while there are really none. 